welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Don't mind me, I was just relaxing. Anyway, we're back in Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, I was about to get this recording all started, and I got close to this mission, and it just kind of started without me doing anything. So just to get in a little recap of what just happened, um, I just came up to the cooking station, and this lady's about to chop the coke in half. Uh, and then the cutscene started, and I paused it right there real quick. So, now let's get into it. Let's see what this lady wants to chop him in half for. Vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll mm -hmm. work, but not this. Sure. Well, I ain't cooking work. Bye. Wait, did you get... Did you see the floating beans? As you can see, right back there. Floating cans. It's magical. My husband also, and I, we shared the work. if you haven't noticed... All of it. Arthur and Morgan, fields, looking good. Hunt, knife, good. Look at him. I, mm. you, mm. I got him a I'll new outfit. This fat old serve him for dinner. I got him a new outfit in town. <laughs> Don't you call her a fishwife? Whoa, that's Come a little risque. Look at look at there? Arthur. Look uh, at he is looking man. good. So mm. so Tell me he doesn't look hunt. good. Tell me. We're hunted. We are hunted. And things hunting us, well, they I'm gonna take the hat off, though. I don't like the hat. I ain't afraid of dying. Okay. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. What? Yeah. What are sure. we doing? Okay, well. There's my list. <laughs> Can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. I will. Come on, princess. Princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? Come on, girl. Let's go do something exciting. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. But yeah. Shut your goddamn mouth. Let's go. Move out of the way, Karen. Sadie. Oh God! Orders from that sweat half wit. I guess we all. Well, he is kind of dumb, but we don't have to call him that. Where's that letter? It's in my butt. Oh. Robin and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Oh, she's feisty. Feisty. I like a little feist in my teammates. Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord. Good old Aunt Kathy. That your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. It's boring. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Oh, I'm excited. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of mm, suitors. Sure. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. That was an interesting letter. Loved that. Loved that a lot. Well, all right, we're in roads. I totally didn't rob a couple people here. All right. Park it right here. Uh, all right. Wait, what? No. Uh, drive to the store. I am literally at the store right now. What? What? Okay. Why did? So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. Oh. You insane. <laughs> what are you doing? Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools and rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head this on This lady's crazy. Buy some food to eat. No guns. You're sure? This are you sure? Good time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. I don't know. Checking the mail is pretty exciting. Maybe I got a letter from Grandma. Maybe there's a... Thick $20 bill in there, you know? Or I guess in this time, a thick quarter. Uh, well, I guess you can do this story. Hello? Sir, good sir. Sorry. Talk to the clerk. Hello, sir. Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Okay, thank you. Okay, no trouble. No trouble. Thank you, sir. What is this? Does that say spaghetti? Hunter's salt. Okay, well, not spaghetti. Not Hunter's spaghetti. I was excited. She just, I'm gonna totally get back here. She's gonna be shooting someone. What? She, uh. My sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out bright blue. 
I'm trying. What is? What? Yeah, how did you, coming. Sadie? How did? What? Sadie. What did you do? I think this is everything. All right. Here, take that for yourself, okay? Okay. Um. Thanks. We'll give it back okay. then. Jesus. <laughs> okay, Sadie's a little crazy. Sadie's a little wild. Get on. I'm about done here. I like Sadie, not I Lady. <laughs> I know. So, you get everything? I, I hope think so. so. And some uh, new clothes, I see. Okay. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. She's like I told you. Oh, is Sadie the one we got from the real sorry. start of the game that you know. That shed, not the shed, like in the very beginning where we first got off our horse, right there. I think that's her. I think so. Okay. That makes a little. Oh, what? What were you? What uh? What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lemoyne Raider Country. Keep it cool. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. Oh, I don't think so. You don't think it's about to pop a cap in both these. Pull over. That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Good God, Sadie. Oh, God, I knew we were going to do something stupid. Gosh dang it, Sadie. I don't know how I hit him. How did I kill them both? Oh, my God, Sadie, what the crap? You're a wild woman. Hey, y'all better run. Popped him. Uh-uh, he ain't getting right. away. I'll drive us back. Good grief, Sadie. You're wild. You just no, freaking trampled that here. game. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. Oh my gosh, Sadie. Are you? We show those bastards. Good grief. Remind me not to get on your bad side. Yeah, and really. Clearly planning to bushwhack us. I mean, I, I, I agree, <laughs> but you're crazy. Oh gosh, you are crazy. You are absolutely crazy. Are you gonna tell? Did yourself kill then, Miss Adler? Not quite. Not quite. I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but hey, be don't be hating I, on my refined I conversations. Out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay at shopping. Yes, at shopping. <laughs> shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove well, you can handle yourself. Big box of sardines. Well, they say I, I think that was sardines. Mess, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay. I'm sure you have. Okay, well, that was a, that was a fun and little quest. Nice pants, by the way. Thank you, thank you, sir. Thank, my pants are great. All right, now I'm going to go shave Arthur up some more, and uh, then we're going to do Duchess quest real quick. So let me go over here. I'm just going to walk my way. Actually, do we have a nice thick bowl of soup before? I see that thick bowl of soup. Javier, you saved some for me, brother. Evening, Arthur. Evening, brother. Who just talked to me? That's a big tree. Oh, come on. Oh, coffee. Me pound some coffee real quick. All right, Dutch. What do we? What you got for us, big man? What you got? What do you have for us? Come here, come here, big boy. What we got? What we got? How you doing, old friend? Oh, you know. Oh, we look. We're like matching. We're looking good. It's funny. Us in and up down here. Is My it funny? daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? No, you Many haven't. Times. I see. I'm boring. You are. There you are a little bit. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, mm -hmm. there's going to be casualties. We're thieves. Yeah. In our world that don't want us no more. Uh, uh, where are we going? We where are we going, Dutch? In an ever where are we world going? You following me? Now, I'll give you that. Oh, can't get away. Come on. Who's that? Follow Must Dutch. Nice okay, there's Sadie right over there. Hosea knows a good fishing spot. Do we leave now? Well, we'll why are we going to fish? I don't want to go fish. I'll do it. 
I already Not fished with Jackson. I don't need to go fish more. Obviously, something's gonna happen. I feel like uh, those Bilbo and Jameson, I can't remember their names, the detectives are gonna pop up. Uh, hop on. Hop on, Tony! Alright, I'm ready. Tony's here. We're ready. Let's go fishing. Alright. Let me show you how it's Show me the way. Where are we going? Follow Hosea. Alright, let's go, Hosea. Passing you. Yeah, okay. Oh, I'm not passing. I'm just trotting. Or, or, or we're not. Or we're not. Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because it's true. I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there, <clears throat> oh, there was a us. The curious couple and our unruly son. Uh -huh. It feels good here. You did well finding that That's spot, Arthur. Big tree in the distance. More Charles and me. It's like I can breathe again. Thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipe some good, Hosea. I was once in this country with Bessie. I feel like you were everywhere like with Betsy. <coughs> it was a lifetime ago. But what is a there life a place that you lived, didn't go with Bessie? Well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, big tree. Holy you have crap. to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. But we don't have to hide. Uh, like where? I got some ideas hatching. But I Hatch. need you with me, not against me. Both well, of you. Be calm. Of course. Still, we'll figure it out. We do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, that's gonna be easy. Just talk to Micah. He's the one that you have to worry about. No trouble. Sadie, watch Sadie too. Dutch just asked the, the gang to not use weapons. See what turns up. Dutch. Okay. You've got to be discreet. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, this is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll be able to play them like a fiddle. Nothing play like them a like a fiddle. But no butts. No butts. I, I thoroughly enjoy butts. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Ah, uh, we're playing it cool, brother. Uh, something's gonna happen. I just know it. Cutscene's about to come. We're playing it cool. Everything's. Watch out. Well, Dutch, we don't have to yell. Oh, is that? Is it? Oh, that's. Why are we stopped? I don't. Hello, know. gentlemen. Well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a spot. Who is this? Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. What? Well, well, look who. How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. Who's that in the back? Is that Mike? Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. It's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. I don't, I don't know what now, we're doing. tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy pop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you. I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have... The Anderson standing. boys. Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur... Chase wanted man uh, and and take Archibald with you. Just what Come on, Archibald. Come we're on, pretending to be guy. good so we Perhaps can get we the can other guy. Stay with that train. Don't let them oh, get we're away. going. We're going, Archibald. That's a cow. Oh, do Come not on, do not shoot. Right. Okay. Come on, we're losing them. Oh, well, we will got it. Relax? We're not losing them. You better cook the rest of the blind woman. Come on. What a dummy! That guy's dead. See if you can get alongside you can. We're almost there. Yes, I can jump on. Hey now. Now he's 
Didn't shoot him. All right, time to run these boys down. Stop in the name of the law. Chase the remaining boys down. Come on. Get like getting away from me. Get back here. Yeah. Okay, why well, you gotta throw the hay down? And you only have a certain, certain amount of train. Let's go. Let's go, big man. Woohoo! I hope that didn't kill him. Come on, boy. Come on, big man. I'm getting him. I'm getting him. Get back here, big boy. Oh, look who you You gonna do this right in front of all this meat? Boy! Oh gosh. Come on, big boy. Try at least. Just don't kill him. Oh, he's cutting me. Oh gosh. Come on. Well, he's freaking slicing the crap out of me. Gosh, he's cutting me up. Come on, big man. Yeah, you want to go? Oh, I'll make you one of these meat patties. Woo! Hello? Oh, hello. We're good. Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Uh, how do I get out of here? Oh, he cut me the crap up. Holy heck. Wow. That was. That was a stressful fight. Ow. I don't feel like fighting him, him with a knife would have been good. I feel like we should have just commotion. quick draw. I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. What now? Take him in. Come on. Like seriously, I feel like we should just quick draw the shot the knife right out of his hand and then start beating him up. Not the train. Load Anders onto the back of your horse there and we'll take him to Sheriff. Oh my gosh, really horse? Really? Why? Oh, you, you are a oh, oh, good. Just in roads. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay, we're gonna stop just ahead on the right, outside the sheriff's office. Outside Can the you sheriff's grab office. Off your horse and carry him in for me. <laughs> hey, fellas. Remove Anderson. You stay right there, Sooner Tony. Get him off your horse. Don't, we can get please him don't cell. poop again. Carry him over then. All right, calm down, calm down. I got him. I'm the one doing the heavy lifting. We got him. Very good. <laughs> I told you, Arthur. This guy looks like um, Edward Scissorhands. So, uh, about my friend here. Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you, this was all just a big misunderstanding. Who's this guy? I don't know him. However, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Well, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly mm -hmm. good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, Thank you, sir. We're just honored to be here. And make your friend behave. I'll try to make him behave. From some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their. I'll digging. brand his butt oh, so terrible. he doesn't do anything else. Come along now. Just... I'll keep this fellow on the straight and. Uh huh. Straight and narrow. Come back mm -hmm. and yep. see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Bah. Oh. He's better be up. It totally looks like it, but it's true. You were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite. I can't oh, thank you. Sorry. Enough. Where have you been? Around. And where <laughs> Around. I'm renting a caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. Oh, that's going to be fun. His he was just talking. Grays and Braithwaite's. Interesting. Mm. Two old plantation houses. Let's do a little family duel. Married We're gonna get in on this. There's a bank okay. right there. You start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I'm sure you I have, sir. I've missed you. I don't even know what your name is, but I've missed you. Years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like 
We can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was I don't know what he means. Super agents. Super, super agents. agents. <laughs> I'd love to meet one. It's just talk. I'm sure it's just talk. But I could not tell you. That's it. Stay out of trouble. Thank you, gentlemen. Super agents. All right. Okay. Well, so oh, we're still we're still doing stuff. Okay. You start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story the is. The Gray's place. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend Archibald. Good. Archibald. You see what you can find out about these great weights. All right. Thank you, Arthur. Yeah, welcome. Quite a fishing trip. Yeah, this is this is some fishing. I'm up for it. I'm I'm glad we haven't fished. This is a lot more exciting. Uh, what are we doing? Except fishing. I don't really want to fish. Uh, I'll need to relax someplace. Don't like the, don't want to fish. Looks like it's you and me, old man. Fishing just does not sound like something I want to do right now. So we're just not going to do that. I'd rather do some real missions. Perfect. New self. Well, I'm going to end this episode right here. Look at those dried goods. Mm -mm -mm. That man is shirtless. Wow. Ooh. Look at this monster of a man. Oh, man. Anyway, I'm going to end this episode right here. I will see you guys in the next Red Dead Redemption video. Thank you for pushing all those buttons down there. And uh, I'll see you again in the next video. Bye. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <clears throat>